Thank you very much. It's great to be here. And thank you very much for the welcome. We love you, Steve. Yeah. Thanks, I think. <laughs> OK, well, listen, we have got a great conference for you guys this week. Um, it's, we've really worked super hard to put this together. Uh, folks from 57 different countries are here this week. Over 1,000 Apple engineers that will be here this week. I'd like to give you a few updates to start with. And I'd like to start with the iPad. Incredible device. It is really changing the way we're experiencing the web. Things like email, photos, uh, you know, maps, video, you name it. And it is magical. I know it because I got this email. <laughs> I was sitting in a cafe with my iPad, and it got a girl interested in me. <laughs> we have sold over 2 million uh, iPads. One every three seconds. <laughs> iPads now in 10 countries. 10 countries today, we're going to be in 19 by the end of July. We're making iPads as fast as we possibly can. So there are now 8,500 native iPad apps downloaded over 35 million times. That's about 17 apps per iPad. I'll tell you about one of our apps uh, that we're updating today, which is iBooks. Uh, users have downloaded over five million books, about two and a half books per iPad, which is terrific. iBooks market share now is up to 22% in just about eight weeks. So now, make notes. One of the biggest requests we've gotten for the iPad is the ability to view and read PDFs. So we've built that now right into iBooks. I'd like to talk about the App Store, something near and dear to all of us. The App Store is a curated platform with over now 225,000 apps. We get about 15,000 apps submitted every week. And they come in in up to 30 different languages that we support. Just guess what? 95% of all the apps we get submitted are approved within seven days. Just last week, we crossed 5 billion downloads on the App Store. Isn't that incredible? How much have we paid developers? Our 70% that we've paid you. How much have we paid you to date? Just a few days ago, we crossed a billion dollars. A billion dollars. So that's the App Store. Now, I'd like to talk about the iPhone. This is Mobile browser usage in the US, and you can see iPhone has 58.2% of the entire mobile browser usage in the country. In 2007, iPhone reinvented what we think of as a phone. In 2008, we added 3G networking and the App Store. In 2009, the iPhone 3GS was twice as fast. For 2010, we're going to take the biggest leap since the original iPhone. We're introducing iPhone 4, the fourth generation iPhone. Now, this is really hot. And there are, there are well over 100 new features. An all new design is beyond any consumer product we've ever seen. Its closest kin is like a beautiful old Leica camera. It's unheard of in consumer products today. Just gorgeous. And it's really thin. This is the new iPhone 4. It is just 9.3 millimeters thick, thinnest smartphone on the planet. Here are the volume controls, volume up, volume down, and mute. On the front, we have a front-facing camera. We have the receiver. We have the home button. We have the micro SIM tray. We have a camera and an LED flash on the back. We look at the bottom. We've got the microphone, the 30-pin connector, and the speaker. And if we look on the top, we've got the headset jack. We've got a second mic for noise cancellation and the sleep-wake button. 
people have asked, what's this? Well, it turns out there's not just one of them, there's three of them, which actually uses the stainless steel band as part of the antenna system. Extraordinary build quality. Again, I don't think there's another consumer product like this, the retina display. What's that? By dramatically increasing the pixel density, four times as many pixels in the same amount of space. Now, why is that important? Is that because we have four times as many pixels, we get really, really sharp text. The retina display, three and a half inches. This, we're using IPS technology. This is a very advanced LCD technology. The iPhone 4 is powered by the A4 chip. You can see that the biggest single component in the phone is the battery. So we have four, up to 40% more talk time on 3G and 300 hours of standby. Up to 32 gigabytes of storage. Broadband HSDPA and HSUPA for 802.11n Wi-Fi, GPS plus accelerometer plus compass. Remember when we added the accelerometer and how that opened up a whole new vista of gaming? Because we're adding a gyroscope. Three axis gyro, which is fantastic. Pitch roll and yaw, also rotation around gravity. A whole new camera system built into iPhone 4. From a three megapixel to a five megapixel sensor, 5X digital zoom, of course, what we pioneered, tap to focus, and we've got an LED flash built in. The camera also records HD video. Full 720p at 30 frames per second. The LED flash also will stay on to illuminate scenes for video recording. Is we've written an application ourselves called iMovie for iPhone. And what you're gonna see was produced entirely on the phone, recorded, edited, rendered, all completely on the phone. iPhone OS 4, the most advanced mobile operating system in the world. It's over 100 new user features as well. The biggest being multitasking. That is just the best in the, in the industry uh, for finding your apps. We're also using it to control all the audio that you might be playing, as well as the uh, locking the rotation into the portrait position. So iOS 4, multitasking, folders, the retina display integration, just again, tons of new features everywhere. This month, we will sell our 100 millionth iOS device. Number seven, iBooks. Download the same book to all your devices at no extra charge. Sync your current place, all your bookmarks, and all your notes across all your devices. Now we've gotten over 150 million accounts for these stores with credit cards. And these stores have had over 16 billion downloads. Number eight. Hey, Johnny. We call this FaceTime. FaceTime video calling. Anywhere there is Wi-Fi and there is no setup required. You can use the front or the rear camera. The video and the audio quality is great. Well, first of all, the iPhone 4 comes in two colors. 16 gigabyte iPhone 4 for $199, and of course, the 32 for $299. This June 24th, shipping in five countries. By the end of September, we are shipping in 88 countries. This is our new baby. I hope you love it as much as we do. Thank you very much.